psychology. Mm -hmm. So uh, Swix asks, what ideas or frameworks from human psychology transfer over to large language models? And are there any that are sort of surprisingly disanalogous? My guess is that many things do transfer over because again, you know, models have been trained on a huge amount of like human text and in many ways like have this like very human like yeah. kind of underlying layer. One worry that I often have is that actually it's a bit too natural for AI models to transfer. You know, it's kind of like if you haven't given them more context on their situation or in ways of thinking about it that might be novel, mm. then the thing that they might go to is the natural human inclination. So if you think about this with like, should I, how should I feel about being switched off? And you're like, well, if the closest analogy you have is death, then maybe you should be very afraid of it. Yeah. And I'm not saying that that's not ultimately going to be true. Maybe it is in fact true after lots of reasoning, but I'm like, this is actually a very different scenario. And so in some ways you actually want models to understand that like in cases where their existence is quite novel um, and, and the facts around what they are are quite novel and have to be grappled with. And they don't just need to take like the immediate obvious analogy from human experience, but maybe there's like a, maybe there's like various ways of thinking about it, or maybe it's an entirely new situation. That's a case where I'm like, you might not want, um, you may, might not want to just kind of very simply apply like concepts from human psychology onto 